Hey, this is Ina with Garden of Ina, and I'm here with Quinny's Kitchen, and we're in my kitchen today. <laughs> and we're going to talk about composting, okay? Composting is basically using your scraps that you have at your home. It could be uh, kitchen scraps, which is what I'm going to show you right now, with your fruits and your vegetables, um, stuff that you're not going to eat or that's gone bad. You can actually save that and reuse it in the garden to make food for the living organisms in your soil. So the purpose of compost is basically bringing life into the soil. Your plants need the bacteria, the fungi, the earthworms, all of that ecosystem to work together in order to feed the plants so that they grow. So you're creating an environment that is alive and active and that will serve all of us, the plants, the creatures that's in the soil, us, the animals, we all work together. So composting is a great way to reuse the stuff that you no longer have a need for, but that can then be brought back to life in the soil. So right here, I have a, um, a Tupperware that I use. You can use anything. You can use a plastic bag, or you can use the bottom of your bin in the refrigerator. But for me, I like to keep things easy, and um, I like a nice flow so that I can stick with it. I've gone through many different um, ways of doing this but this this method works for me so I just have a Tupperware bowl and um, I'll demonstrate what I'm going to put in here right now which is just my leftover tea scraps okay just leftover tea scraps I had some tea and now I'm just going to basically put this put this into my bin Okay, put it in there. It's got all kind of stuff. I have apple cores in there. I have a lot of tea scraps. I have some water because I rinsed this out and I like to keep all the wonderful juices in there. And I just simply, once I'm done with whatever I'm putting in there, put the lid back on and I put it in the fridge until this container is full. The reason why I keep mine in the refrigerator is because this cuts down on, and I also keep it closed up, is because this cuts down on gnats and smell. This is, this, this is old material. This is stuff that's breaking down. So it's gonna naturally um, create bacteria and fungi, okay? I don't necessarily want that out on my counter. <laughs> Some people do, but that's not my style. So I keep it in the refrigerator and then I allow all that to happen outside. Um, in addition to food scraps, I also uh, save seeds. This is outside of composting, but I also save seeds. So this is some squash that I have here. I also dry herbs that I'll use for um, teas and things like that. And then as you can see over here, I actually save uh, onions and garlic or whatever it wants to grow, potatoes, for the next planting season. So you, you always got opportunity to grow. What, one other thing I'd like to show you is down here, or I'll bring it up, is I have a station in my house where I keep and recycle paper towel rolls, paper products, things that, that is compostable. I wouldn't necessarily put this into my kitchen scrap container, but I also save it for you know bringing it outside, which is where we'll go next. All right, so we're gonna get ready to go out there. I'll see you guys in a moment. Again, this is Ina with the Garden of Ina here with Quinny's Kitchen talking all things compost and gardening.